Philadelphia trying to knock the Bruins off in this afternoon tilt. He was dominant here the other night. Underway, Kevin Miller will send the puck in. Usually it's when you're hitting the, the foot, right, where you get the, the numbness and your leg goes out, not the knee, right? There's a shot by Clifton to save by Elliott. The rebound off toward the corner. Never before in a season that they played in more than six games. This year with the different divisions and such. They're playing for an eighth time. Here's DeBrusque with speed, cutting it in. The shot, and that went off of Elliott, and then the glass. At Grizzlick, the fine skating defenseman, moves it on the left wing. This is Corrali, trying to get around behind the Philadelphia net. Chris Wagner there, allowed to walk out in front for the shot, and Elliott to save. Back to the point it goes, that shot by Miller blocked. Down on the ice goes Sanheim, the puck dribbles back to Elliott. And then the wraparound attempt by Wagner and Brian Elliott. Let's get the puck and move back. Grizzly from the red line, sending it in. It'll skip to Elliott. He'll let the Flyers play it, but Gatsas Bear lost it into the slot. Bergeron, he scores! Eighth goal of the year for Patrice Bergeron against the Flyers. Off a turnover, it's 1-0 Boston. There's the play behind the net. Elliott was going. Shane's talking to him, and Gosses Bear picks the puck up, but has his pocket picked. And Bergeron in his usual spot, quietly waiting for the puck to be retrieved. Smith gets it to Bergeron. Flyers need to find a combination to shut some of the bigger lines down. Sanheim a shot, and there they get one in on Swayman, and he bats it away. Now Voracek blast, but that's rejected, and out goes Corrali the other way. They feel as though it's not there. They will make the change pretty quickly in terms of the line combinations. It appears to go back to the gone. And this probe off a shot here, and a save by Swayman. There's Voracek to the right side. The shot, but that is a save made by Swayman. Or a check. Up this way with it to San I'm across. One timer. Hey, he says, rebound, Connectney. He scores! Connectney buries the rebound, and the game is tied at one. That was Connectney. There's the shot by Hank. It's a heavy shot, but it's a one that is right on the goaltender. The rebound, not a good one. A great one for Connectney as he slides in there and scoops it to the back of the net. Great reaction from Konechny on that rebound. Low for Corrali. Corrali able to center, goes all the way through. Shot goes on, and the save made by Elliott. Uh, Konechny chipped, but didn't get it past Wagner, who fires save. Elliott, and now from the angle, a shot denied by Elliott. Looking for Marshan. He's got it up the left wing. Braun comes over. Marshan stepped to the middle, got it to Smith for the shot. Save Elliott. Voracek, pass up the right wing, Konechny with speed in across the line, takes the shot, Swayman the save, and no rebound. And a little bit of late contact. And the Bruins will clear it all the way It was a short-handed goal by the Bruins that broke the tie here the other night. 31 seconds. Well, dangerous that way, too. The Flyers' power plays dropped to 21st, but they look good here. Konechny down the miss, Costas bare to the net, and it's 2-1. It's offside. It's a close play at the line. JVR to connect the Gostas Bear with a nice touch in front of the net. Very similar to the pass Connecty made to Voracek a couple of games ago. And Shane's got the goal, but Connecty's made a major contribution to this first period in multiple ways. The pass this time, the goal previously. Back up the goals, and the Flyers have a 2-1 lead after period number one. So we're underway here in the second period. Noticing that no Matt Grizzly at least to start the period on the Boston bench. Richie into the middle. Bergeron had that one tipped. Still able to find Marchand back across ice. Pasternak, save Elliott! And kick down goal by Pasternak. He's got it back behind the net. The brush. Back toward the net, that's off of Coyle, back to DeBrusque. DeBrusque fires one, that's blocked. Back to Zaboral. Zaboral, the camper. Camper holding on into the slot, tip. Goes wide, back out in front, DeBrusque, he scores! Jake DeBrusque, who's been a force in this game, ties the game at two, beating Elliott from the slot. And it's a really hard-working shift with a lot of good puck movement and retrievals. Just watch the effort by DeBrusque as he battles front to get position and then eventually snaps that nifty backhand pass from Craig Smith right to the top of the net. No chance for Elliott there as he's just trying to get back and get his angles. And running out of bodies right now, so 
Bruins already missing Matt Grizzly. I think Anton Bleed returned to the line. Well, big third period starts, and it'll have to be a different kind of third period than we see between these two teams this year. The number is not pretty for the Flyers. 15 shots for the Flyers. Faraby cuts in, stops. Backhands around behind the net. Couturier there to Van Riemsdyk in the slot. Faraby, pass off Couturier. He scores! Just about to say one pass too many, as it turned out. Just enough passes, and the Flyers had the lead back 3 2 Couturier. There's the entry in the zone, JVR with a little chip pass. Faraby smartly on the backhand puts that around the wall. Some help there from Couturier, and then JVR starts the pretty passing play. Faraby with a good read right here. The pass fools the goalie, and Couturier is able to kick oh. it from his backhand. Of and disadvantage, Konechny jumps in a loose puck here, right across the Boston line. Drop pass for a check, with a shot, save Swayman. Oh, that's to Moran for a shot, and the glove save by Swayman. He'll hang on, we step aside past the midpoint of the third. Camper to Krejci, takes a look, back to Camper. Other side of the ice, in front tip, save Elliott. And now a chance to clear, and they'll try this side and get it past Krejci, and all the way down, Lawton with a clear. Comes back toward Gostas Bear, now it's for a check. Around by high stops, waits, flips to Konechny. Konechny holds on, back out, got to for the shot! Score! Paint. And you can see why the Bruins were making their argument. Bruce Cassidy now will challenge the call on the ice. If there's goaltender interference prior to the goal. I don't think this will go the Flyers' way. You never know, but I oh, you say. never know. We've been surprised by these before, but it looked as though the contact clearly. After coach's challenge, it's determined there is goaltender interference prior to the goal. Therefore, we have no goal. But gets that bucket cross ice off the stick of Faraby. Turn to Marchand for the shot and the glove saved by Elliott. First run just pushes it back there. We got part of it, not all of it. Marsham with a quick snapshot trying to use Ron as a screen, but Ron, the veteran, alertly moved. It's through connecting. Zaboral is on it in the corner. Zaru will get on him. Now Corrali. Checked by Zaru. The puck to connect. He tries to tuck it in. Swayman trying to pin it. It was loose. There's the puck back behind the net now. Konechny's on top of Camper, and they're on top of the puck. And this one goes to the boards. Marchand couldn't come up with it. Provorov tips. Krejci, one last shot, goes wide of the net. They battle for it there. Two seconds, one, and it is over. The Flyers hang on for the 